Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Too Many Super Nintendo Games. They're all bad. Every Super Nintendo game is bad. Let's see what bad game we play next. It is going to be bad. Tick. This was a good TV show. And of course they made a bad game about it. Let's see how bad. There's no telling. Oh, it's Chapuitan wonders if it's a terrible platformer or not. It's a terrible platformer. I can guarantee that. I will buy somebody a gift sub if this turns out to be a beat-em-up. This is unskippable, by the way. Lives, all of them, continues. I get four Arthurs, sure. Can we go please, thank you. Oh my goodness, it is a beat-em-up. I owe somebody a gift sub. I can kick. Do I have a punch? I have a jump. Why, why did they do this? Okay, so punch is A, and kick is Y, and jump is B. They put jump in the middle of the punch and kick buttons. Also, I jumped off the bus. Because, of course, let's have that mechanic, too. Can't help but notice I could not set it to easy, but... Wait, this has become a platformer now. Do I, do I not have to do a gift sub then? How are you supposed to dodge this? You're the tick. You have, you have a delay on every jump. How are you supposed to dodge anything? What was that? Why did that exist? And now it's a beat-em-up again. And now the jumps aren't delayed. The jumps were delayed for the platforming part, where you had to dodge things. Did a separate developer make that platforming level? In a different engine? Can you put more than one engine on the same cart in the Super Nintendo era?
This is the button mashiest of button mashy games. sit here and kick forever. Uh, the Tick is a big blue superhero. cartoon, the animated cartoon, I don't know about the comic book, but it, like, it made fun of and hung a lampshade on a lot of superhero tropes. I definitely recommend literally any other adaptation of the tick than video game. But I mean, the, the fact that the first level is called the Night of the Million Zillion Ninjas is pretty emblematic. be done, please. I don't want to actually fight a million zillion ninjas. This isn't fun. Like, it's, it's the best thing I've played today, but that doesn't mean that this is fun. Not done. Okay, this is nothing. Deconstruction, that's the word I was looking for. Thank you, Malik. Well, this is not a deconstruction of a video game. This is just a bad video game. Oh my god, I'm back in platforming hell. Let me be done. I don't I don't want to do this anymore. Why is this in the game? How did that hit me? It was over my head. 
Why is this so long? Why is anything? Am I supposed to be doing something? I'd rather fight the ninjas than have to deal with more bullshit projectiles. I can't even jump in this part. Like, this at least is, like, a better design than jumping across rooftops for no freaking reason. But that's still not fun. Maybe they think that a not fun video game is a deconstruction of a video game. Hey, now I get to kick forever again. move as fast as I can. I can't ever catch them if you do that. doesn't have the jump kick as the strongest move. Like, I can't even hit them with jump kicks. What is up with this? it up a bit. Let's match the other button for a little while. This is the most boring game. It's the most boring game that I'm not even gonna be able to win because I've already lost four lives, most of which were due to bullshit platforming. does have nice music, I will grant it that. It probably st just is using music from the cartoon, though, so I can't give it too much credit. Caravan, why do you have this game and why is it so bad? I, 
I know, I was thinking I ought to save Arthur for a boss, but I'm starting to think there are no bosses. Caravan says there are bosses, so yeah, I'll save Arthur for bosses. Maybe I should use Arthur in the platforming sections, because honestly, who cares? Really? That long after he has stopped moving, he's still a hurt box. Terravan, I'm on Act 3. And I have continues. And I'm literally just button mashing. I'm on Act 1, Stage 3, says Malik. This is Chapter 3. a fourth type of ninja. What thrilling gameplay this is. How does the speedrun of this game go? Do they just not speedrun this game because it's a six hour slog? Caravan, I, I, what are you wrong about? It's three hours. Instead of six. I can understand why nobody would want to speedrun this game. It sucks. I mean, this would only be the first official speedrun if it's faster than the long play. Which I doubt. Sick. My brain is going numb from headphones. 
pumping the same music into my ears over and over. point of a task of this game, you can't optimize anything. It's pure button mashing. Box, I can. I just throw it once and that's it. How lame. Oh, X apparently summons Arthur. Arthur swooped and that was it. That was literally it. says interactive background. I don't believe that. Background might be a hazard. But that's not the same as interactive. Get that tick, you think. There's, there's nothing. There's nothing for me to do. Like, that's nothing. an enemy I have to fight or is it just a hazard I think it's just a hazard
Yeah, at least it one hit KO's enemies. Done? No. I think that was the first health pickup in the game. No, Shapuitan, there's not infinite continues. I have six left. It is incredibly limited. I can't seem to throw anybody. I can't seem... Wow, that didn't even kill him. Apparently kicks are stronger than punches. Good to know. I was doing it right the whole time. There's no story, Malik. I don't know why you were trying to troll the rest of the Twitch chat. They can plainly see that there is no story. There are title cards. And that's it. I'm not skipping cutscenes. There are no cutscenes. No, original Pac-Man had little cutscenes. Maybe I'm thinking of Ms. Pac-Man. But there were little cutscenes in between a certain number of levels. I might just be thinking of Ms. Pac-Man. Original might not have had that.
Boy, remember when Ninja Gaiden came out for the NES and had, like, animated cutscenes that were, like, really crude, just sliding panel animations, but animated cutscenes in a Nintendo game. How far we've fallen that we're a generation later and we get title cards and that's it. Zeekstrai, thank you so much for the subscription. I'm sorry that you had to come in on such a bad day of such terrible games that this button mashing non-game is the best of the bunch so far. So, oh my goodness. Is this a boss? He has iframes and a different model. I can't summon Arthur. is going to kick my ass. I can't hit him during his swings, which is some straight BS. So yeah, he's just invincible for the entire duration of his attacks, on top of having iframes after getting hit. And he has a million health because he's still alive. And I can't summon Arthur to help me kill him. There's no speedrun of this. There's nothing. This game doesn't exist. I have, I'm convinced that I'm just delirious from the first two terrible games that I'm hallucinating this, this epitome of mediocrity. Like I saw the tick and I'm thinking, oh, it's, it's a, it's, they're attempting to deconstruct video games by just having a bad game without understanding that that's just a bad game. And then Ryan Johnson played this as a kid and it inspired his entire film career and was responsible for bringing us The Last Jedi, so uh, everything is the Tick's fault. Just gift shop, but Ninja World gift shop. If there was a if there was a story to this game, we would be beating up just poor children who were customers of the gift shop and wearing costumes and wielding foam ninja stars, and we're just beating the crap out of them. But instead, this game has no story. Instead, the game has nothing.
Uh, you can bring it down to an even 230, Zeke. I, I choose not to. I choose life. Okay, so Arthur is a screen clear, I am learning. Except it takes a while to summon him, so I can still just take hits. I think that's faster to kill the ones that actually take two full combos to kill. To just juggle them. done? No. I don't know why this game has a point system. Why does this game have anything? Why does this game exist? Why are we alive? Just to suffer? I 
just want to be done. Yeah, there's just ninjas. Even the even the boss slash mini boss was just a ninja with a face. What a health pickup. I've had one of those. I don't even know what that was. I think that was in no, it wasn't an extra life. I don't think. We've got the good old object in the foreground because we think the video game is a camera. Instead of a screen. I would, I would love for this to be over now.
Yay, it did nothing. Oh my goodness, it's a boss. Who again, takes one hit and then has a year of iframes. And cannot be hit during his own attacks, just has pure iframes during his own attacks. So, good luck with this. be able to do something to enemies that are knocked down, but I can't. game ever. This isn't the worst game ever. We do have different enemies now. And also that. Also notice that we've abandoned the jumping across rooftops platformer sections, thank god.
love to be able to hit an enemy with this thing. Oh my god, I did. It was the weakest one possible, but still. Oh, the slowdown. Also, my partner has no range. Yes, but she has no range in this video game. No, I was just saying I'm done with them. I think I think we're just gonna we're just gonna drop a savey save here and call it an episode and a stream and be done because my wrist is actually hurting from the mashing. I need one of those uh, ice pack things that like pro gamers have for their hands and wrists. This has been a terrible day. Thank you all so much for watching, and until next time, take care.